Ethan, I'm from Louisiana. My drug of choice is amphetamines. Um, I started using when I was 14. First time, started with marijuana and drinking. Uh, I always did what I wanted, came from an abusive home. And, uh, that was kind of my outlet, was using. And uh, I had this sense of uh, nobody was gonna tell me what to do. I had no uh, respect for authority in any kind of way. And that continued through my adolescence. I was in and out of rehabs and juvenile detention centers. Somehow I managed to complete six years in the armed forces before getting discharged. But two years prior to discharge, they made me go to a rehab. It was either that or get a dishonorable discharge. So I went and uh, did complete the program. I stayed seven days. And by that time, that was whenever my addiction was at its, at its very worst. It, I had started using amphetamines like Adderalls, five ants, and I'd do that to get through the work day. But then I started taking them even when I wasn't at work. It became my recreational drug. And I'd come off of those and I'd have to have something to make them come down a little less harsh. So I'd use marijuana, drink, whatever, whatever was around really. And that continued for years. Uh, so then after six years of this vicious cycle, um, Thanksgiving Day this past year, just last month, um, my little nephew was playing ping pong with my little sister and he lost. He's 11 years old. And I said to him, oh, you, you know, you, you let a girl beat you. And he turned around without hesitating and told me, you let life beat you. And that just really sunk in my mind because he was right. He was completely right. Despite who I was or what I had accomplished, he was completely 100% correct on that. I had let life beat me. I was strung out at a family get together and everybody could see it. It was completely obvious. So then after that, I was like, okay, well, you know, either I can off myself, I can kill myself, or I can do something about this. And lucky for me, I had a friend that was already down here at Palm Partners. He had posted on Facebook, hey look, all my dope sick friends, y'all need some help. Palm Partners is offering help. If you have health insurance, it'll cover it, you know? So made a call and uh, I was on a plane two days later, came down here and it has been life-changing, entirely life-changing. It's so different from other rehab facilities because they, they associate the recovery program with more fun and passion. And, um, it makes it worthwhile. It makes it a, you're not counting every day and, and thinking about getting out. You're, it gives you the time to renew yourself and really get to know yourself and love yourself, which is a first for me and a lot of other people. And, um, altogether, I, I couldn't be in a better place now. I, they gave me the tools, they gave me everything I needed to live a better life, a sober life. And it's been life changing. Call Palm Partners, they can change your life. Thank you.